<laughs> wow, what kind of damn settings is that? You know what I'm saying? I'm over here expecting something more than that. Well, what's up, y'all? Today we're playing Haunted Investigation. Now listen, I'm not expecting much from this game. I had it sitting on my computer for shit, probably a month. You know what I'm saying? Probably a little over a month. And the way they describe this game, they describe it as pretty much the scariest experience you could ever experience in any kind of experience. They put it off as like, I don't know, a 35 to 40 minute game where you could play with people or play by yourself. And it's one of them things where I'm just kind of, you know, I ain't, I ain't expecting much. Like, is it a store game or is it a just a co-op game with objectives in it? I don't know. Because if you're putting a time on it, then clearly it's a linear, a linear experience, but who knows? Wow, it's taking a real long time for this game to, you know, load up. Well, they, they must be loading in all the scary stuff, like all the experiences, you know what I'm saying? They put this game as like just a grand experience. And I ain't bullshit. I'm going to show y'all like towards the end, you know what I'm saying? I'm going to show y'all exactly what they say. Finally, Jesus Christ, that took forever. The year is 19, 1940. I'm in a pretty modern car for 1940. You know what I'm saying? And you've taken on the case of a potentially haunted house as an investigator. Despite many other skilled investigators turning down a case, you see it as an opportunity to make a name for yourself. Armed with only a flash. <laughs> Arm with all that flashlight, you make your way. So you mean to tell me my my flashlight is a weapon? Is that what you're telling me? Listen, the car I came in was pretty. What my car? At? Did did I either did I take a Uber in 1940 or did I drive my car and, and 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 maybe it's in my pocket? Maybe I got one of them there. I got one of them there, little you know pocket cars. You know what I'm saying? Like I press a button and it expand, and then I press a button again and it despan. I don't know if despan a word, but I said it. And they got stamina. That is the dumbest shit. You know what I'm saying? This is where the guards stay. And this is where they teach you to play the game. And you can hide. I think that's dumb. To my beloved wife. Darling, I will soon come home. I will get my first paycheck and I will quit this job. Strange things are happening. Don't ask me why I got aggressive. It's just, I'm, I'm, I'm ah, this job, man. I just want to quit this fucking job and i just uh i think it's just in my mind but i'm here footsteps oh my job kids laughing and bangs into the wall i'm probably just tired of this job but clearly this place and this job is just not for me i'll see you soon with love your dear john who hates his job uh, i hate my job my job sucks anyway enough about my job y'all don't care about my problems you know what i'm saying y'all just want to watch somebody you know entertain you guys yeah, this seemed like it could be a a, a decent little co-op game. Hey, stop! You stop it. So is this gonna be a walking game, or am I am I walking to my destination? Oh, I was walking to my destination. Yeah, for a game set in 1940, this seemed like a real modern. Who the hell was that? Hmm, not important. Oh no, is it? Oh, hell nah. I'm not going in there. Look at that shit. Man. <laughs> Who in the fuck do you think I am? Oh, it ain't nowhere to go. It's just a... I got keys. Do I got an inventory? Nope. No inventory. You could have gave me an inventory, but I got some keys, I guess. I got some keys. I got some of them there keys. Oh, I needed them keys. Guess we going in the house. I'll be real... Who was that? I'm sorry. Were you uh, saying something? I'd be surprised if this game scared the shit out of me. You know what I'm saying? It looked cheap. But you never know. Sometimes it's the cheap games that surprise you. Can I get that? Nah, I would if it was me. Now, why the hell can I hide? Fuck that. Nope, sorry. I don't play by them kids. Then yeah, one thing about it, I, I hate kids in games. Kids be the worst in real life and in games. Oh, wow. Look at that family. I bet they was a nice family. I bet that family is so nice. It's crazy. I should probably find something to break this. Huh, you mean like this hammer on the table? Is that what you're talking about? Because it's right there. It's like, Step, just, just grab me. I, I, listen, just grab me, Step. I'm meant for this. I've been waiting on this my whole life. I'm sorry, Hammer. I just can't do it. They won't let me. You seem like the obvious choice for the job, but they just didn't want to hire you. You know what I'm saying? I don't know why. It, it, it sounds like some companies, they sit there and swear to God they're hiring people, and then when you apply for the job, you, you could even be, you know, 
one of the potential candidates for the job. But then they just like, nah, we just don't want you. I guess I'm going upstairs. Because it ain't nothing else to do. And they got a lot of hiding cabinets. You know what I'm saying? A lot. Like, it's, it's too many. How many you you expect me to hide in all of them at the same time? You want me to stack them all together and just hide in them? It's not going to happen like that. I don't know what that is. Yep. Mm. Oh, wow. Look at that lady right there. I don't know if you was real or if that's your makeup. Oh, they all... Well, he real, but the rest, though, they might just be masks. You know what I'm saying? Locked like every other damn door in this house. Madam, how you doing? Oh shit, look who it is. It's that girl from the rain. She locked us here. It's so dark and cold. I just want my parents back. If nobody if anybody sees this letter, please come help us. We're hiding inside the storage room upstairs. I hope she didn't find us. Pretty sure she did. Key. Pretty sure. That got me a little bit. I'm not even gonna sit there and cap. You know what I'm saying? It is what it is. Just you you never know. It be them unexpected scares that get you. You know what I'm saying? This I don't know, man. It's kind of, I hope I ain't got to run. I hope, like, hiding is just a, a little red hair and they kind of throw at you to make you think you got to hide. But you never know. That's locked. That's locked. Well, maybe I just got to go upstairs. How about we just go upstairs? But, no, I can't go upstairs because they won't let me use the hammer. I found it. Oh, no, it's the mannequin. Do I got to build this damn thing? Nah, you crazy. Find three dolls and I'll help you. Yeah, how are you going to help me? Well, you know what? No, let me not even question that because, hey, it's uh, anything happening in these damn horror games. I'm going to tell you that straight up. Like that baby. That baby happened. Somebody made that baby. I'm not even going to lie to y'all. Somebody made that damn baby. Somebody had to make the baby. So don't, don't think it ain't possible for that damn doll or mannequin thing to help me. When somebody made that damn creepy ad baby. Anyway, enough of that. Let's keep it going. Let's keep it going. Honestly, though, I, I'd appreciate it if it's just a 35 to 40 minute game of just this. You know what I'm saying? I like games like this where it's simple. Just me, you know, dealing with jump scares and stuff like that. And just, is that a nice no, magnifying glass? Yeah, they, I, I, I hope it ain't too much of that running away crap. Maybe the running away gonna be some kind of like scripted thing. Is it some down there? Nope. Anything in here? Piece of paper. Good day, mister. We're writing to inform you about the medical state of your wife. The results have came in and she was diagnosed with dementia. We advise you to bring her in. So, wait, is, the, is his wife the one crawling around here like some damn psycho? Hmm? I'm hearing a lot of random noises like people walking and crawling. Dude. Well, I thought I saw somebody. That was about to get real freaky for a second. Yep, I was. I said I was about to get real freaky up in this bad boy. Damn baby. Excuse me. We've been here for at least a hundred years. She trapped our souls in this house and caused us her children. I just want to be set free. I don't want to stay in this place anymore. I'm sorry for everyone that enters this house. If you're reading this, uh, it's too late. Just listen to it so she. Just listen to it so she her won't get mad. Wow, you just kind of butchered the shit out of that. Got it. Hey. I ain't look. I ain't look. I wanted to look, but it happened when I, or I already wasn't even looking. So I got a doll. That's cool. But I still need a key, unless it's a key on the ground. Did you drop a key when you tried to jump scare me? Damn, you, you would think I got to get the damn hammer, though. Right? Come on. Don't that sound like the obvious choice? But nope. No way, Steph. No way, you can never get the hammer. The hammer will never be yours. And it's like, well, shit. Oh, this open? This one. Wow, that was decent. I'll give you that one. That was decent. I, I thought I was dead. That, I accepted my fate. We finally moved to our new house. Hope, I hope we can leave everything behind and stop thinking about all the bad things that happened. I hope it's just like that. You know what I'm saying? My husband is really trying to change. It's been two weeks since he didn't have a drink and it's better like this. Our kids and I have had enough and this fresh start should be everything we need. Oh, you think that? They got me spitting all over the place. You think that? So I guess when you get a doll, 
they pretty much just unlock doors. You know what I'm saying? Even though they, they say they're locked and blah, blah, blah. I'm just saying I'm going to close that one. Got another doll. This open. Right? No. Nope. Just open that. You got to be prepared. You can never be too prepared. You can never be too prepared. Well, somebody's upstairs. Hey, got it. They just had to make the noise. You just had to make the noise. If you wouldn't have made the noise, I wouldn't be in this damn thing. This closet. I wouldn't be in there. But you had to make the noise. You make the noise. I hide. So, I got all three dolls. Let's get the freak out of here. Well, somebody running around this bitch. Nah, I'm good. You can keep that shit. Oh, damn, they won't let me go. So you just gonna... Really? You gonna make me watch this? You gonna make me watch this? I'm gonna hide. I can't hide. Oh, that was so shit. Well, got my thumbnail for this game. Is that a key? Give me that key. They should show you or tell you what keys go well. I got to sit here and play scavenge hunt. I got to play scavy hunt. Over here trying to figure out what doors go and what keys go well. But before I do that, I got to figure out where this damn thing at. I'm pretty sure. Well, I found the, the room. Oh, man, I'm not going in there yet. At least it's open. It was an axe hanging by the head. How you hang an axe by the head? At that point, you dealing with a crazy kid. No, crazy is just an understatement. You dealing with you dealing with somebody who would dead as they that's that's somebody that would take over the world. I got all your dogs. La la. Don't make me punch you, little girl. The the light could have been brighter too, but maybe finding the the things was the best thing to do. So this is the room with the axe in it, right? What the hell is this? Oh, I was already in there. What the hell that room at with the axe in it? I think that room might be right here. This that room right here? Yeah, this that room right here. Oh, I need that. I'm not looking over there. Oh, I'm looking. I'm sorry. Did you say something? Huh? You said you was right behind me. All right. Uh, so much for that. I thought you was going to be something fun. I took <laughs> Oh shit, they say hide. I'm hiding. I'm hiding. I'm hiding. I'm getting out. I'm starting to think this game probably not as survival-esque as I'm thinking. You know what I'm saying? So we got to ask for the boards on the thing. Cool. Yeah, I'm pretty sure everything in this game, I probably ain't even need to hide. I, I bet it was just one of them little. What's all the demonic? What's up with all that demonic? It's some shit right there. And you're going to stay there. You're gonna stay there. You're gonna I'm gonna let you stew for a little bit. I'm gonna let you think about what it is you're thinking about. Square X triangle circle. So what? Four, I bet. You gotta wait. Yeah, one thing I'm not doing is playing with kids right now. So four blank three one, I bet. I bet it's got to do with the, you know, the 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 size of the numbers. So we're gonna do we're gonna do four blank three one and then we're gonna keep just we're gonna go through the numbers on this x so that ain't it how about zero for the the the, the circle because i'm guessing it's going for size and the circle ain't got no size but i done seen games put one as a circle because it's just like it's a shape oh, i see bloody footsteps so i gotta find oh they they go right here well 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 i'll figure that out in a minute that's locked do i need to go What's that? Got another key. 
do I need to go see who the hell over here making all them demonic noises, or was that enough? You you got tired of you got tired of doing it because I you know I wasn't coming over there. You damn idiot. Hmm. Oh, found this. What? What? Why you doing all that Psst, shit? I don't know what to do with this. Me neither. But maybe you might need it. What's up with the pst? Don't be pst me if you don't need me. You feel me? You do that again, I'm going to rip your damn tongue out. Straight out your mouth. Me and my husband started fighting again. What our, what our kids went through today was horrible. He started drinking again, and we got in a fight. They ended with me getting hurt. I've had enough, Mom. I'll come in two weeks home. I'll come in two weeks home with the kids. He must not find out about this. I'll try to act as normal as possible. Wait, what the fuck? I've had enough. Mom, I will come in two weeks home with the kids. What that is? Oh, your daughter. Oh, I got it. I got it. Yeah, that's kind of bad when the, when the dad just getting kind of, you know, what the hell is that? Oh, that's a knife and a syringe. Yeah, when the dad getting abusive like that and you know he drunk as shit, clearly the mom tried to hold on for dear life to save that damn marriage. But he just ain't, he ain't getting nowhere. Anybody who drink, that's why I don't even like, I don't like being around people who drink. You know what I'm saying? Like, I could tolerate people who drink, but people who get drunk, it's just a no-no. I don't like it. You know what I'm saying? It's just not my thing. They want to take my children. I'm not letting them. So the square is three. How about we go ahead and just put that in my phone? So we got that first number. Let's go. Let's go. So the first number clear. Let's go find the third, the other three. If I could find three numbers, then I'll just brute force the other one because it ain't, you know, it's nothing. And then what's up with all these cabinets, my dude? Like, they got all these random cabinets and closets you can hide in, but it ain't no threat in this game, and I'm already calling bullshit. You know what I'm saying? It's just they want you to make it, they, they want to make you think it's a threat, which I ain't got no problem with. I hope it's just like this. Anything over here? Storage room? I don't know what to do. Whoa, what the hell? So we got to cross some candles, and I'm pretty sure I'm going to need to find them at a later date. Probably going to need to make a pentagram, well, make a circle with all that stuff, and then banish the demon. I'm going to banish the demon. The hell was that? Uh, eventually, I'm going to have to go over there and see what this damn girl doing on the ground. I think I might be ready to come talk to your scary ass. Psych, I lied. I ain't ready to come talk to your scary ass. Did I ever come in here? No. This is different. That's a big knife. A bit shame that. A bit shame that went in my ribs. My ribs! My ribs! What's this? The triangle is four, though. I think that was the third number. Yeah, the X was second. Triangle third. Got that. Now we need one more. We get another one, then I'll be... You gonna make me hide. I wanna call you bluff, but you really gonna make me hide. I think I've reached my climax. It's time to talk to you. Hey, baby. What the deal is, dog? You want a hug? No, you don't want no hug from me. I don't want to hug your stank ass. I don't want to hug your stank ass. Is that another one? Help us, we're inside. Well, you got to wait. I got way too many things to be doing at this point. Is that another one? No, I don't want to stay with you. You smell funny. So we got three numbers. I'm going to turn around. If you ain't there, oh, well. What? Why you keep messing with me, you little stupid dog? <laughs> I just called that girl a stupid dog. Sorry. I didn't mean to call the child a stupid dog. I really don't need... And I'm thinking to myself, is this going to be one of them games where I could brute force it with three different numbers? Or or do I need to get all four? Because I done played some games where you got to get all the numbers in a code just to use the lock. You know what I'm saying? Because it's some kind of activation thing in the system. You feel me? In the coding. Yeah, but in some in most games, it's it's one of them things where you could just kind of, you know, bypass it by brute forcing it with like two or three numbers, and you'll be good. But you know, for the sake of jump scares and shit like that, I think I just want to play the game the right way and get all the numbers. Yeah, so it's an eight, and you can see it real faded in the background. So we got all four numbers. Yeah, so you can't say I cheated. So I got all the numbers like a boss because I'm a boss. You know what I'm saying? So that's all the numbers. 
Let's go ahead and get the hell out of here. Oh, I hear somebody humming again. Do you want to get punched? You want punch? I'm not talking fruit punch. I will literally punch you in the face. I will punch a kid. I'm sorry. It, it, Steph, you're such a monster. It's like, well, stop, tell these damn demonic ass kids to stop messing with me. Three, seven. And you know what I appreciate about this game? It ain't like, I played a game recently. Uh, what is called? Cursed Bet. If y'all ain't seen that video already, don't worry. It's on the way. Or if it is up, just go watch it. But in that game, they got a real slow method for putting in a code. You know what I'm saying? Whereas in this game, it's real fast and real simple. They got two buttons to use and you get through the code. I appreciate that. You know what I'm saying? 3748. Let's go ahead and get through this. No, nope, that's not what I wanted. 3748. Like a boss. Yeah. Nice. Jump, jump scare? Not jump cut, jump scare. I'm pretty sure I'm going to need them candles and that damn cross. Start ritual. Yep, I already knew it. Me knew it. Take this light to find five candles and a red cross to start banishing y'all. Only hope please save us. Help me. I will when I get the chance. I know where some of them like them candles at, but it's just, it's one of the things about finding them again. There go one right there. Now, do I need to drop them one at a time, or is it going to be a thing where I can just drop them, and, you know, well, I mean, I can collect as many as I want to until I get all five, because I hope that's the thing. I, don't, I wouldn't want to have to sit here and be running around here one at, no, I can I can carry more than one. I'm not your mom. If you even remotely come at me thinking I'm your mom, I'm going to kick you out the, the house. I'm dead. That's just going to. I'm not even going to sit there and be violent about it. I'm going to just, I'm going to really give you a stern talking and tell you to get, just get out the house. Just go. Just get out. Two candles so far. What are the three? I remember it being two in one room. And I think this is where the cross at. Yep, they go to the cross. I could have swore it was a, a, a candle in here, but nah. I want to say it's some downstairs. Where they go one? That's three. I want to say it's some downstairs. Maybe two downstairs. Because I know if I go straight ahead. Nope, there go another one. Four. Nice. We getting somewhere. I could have swore it was two in here, but nah. I bet the last one downstairs. I, I think I remember seeing another one on the counter downstairs, so we're going to check. It, it. Well, if you're not going to kill me, then don't touch me, stinky. Huh? How about them apples? You like them apples? Do you even like apples? Do dead people like apples? That's a real good question, dog. Dude, leave me alone. Why you keep telling me to help you? Clearly, I'm trying. You see me trying. I know you watching me. Leave me alone before I stop trying to help you. Dude, if you ask me, I promise you, Jimmy. I'm going to call you Jimmy. Timmy, if you ask me that one more time, I'm going to flip this whole house on his back. Then you ain't going to have nobody. No house. You're just going to be a trapped soul outside. Oh, my God. That was so damn hard to find. Wow. Yeah, I knew it was two in one room. I think it was another one in that room. But I found it. That's all that matter. Now, where the hell is room at? I think it couldn't have been over here. Or was it? No, because that's some locked rooms. Or maybe this is it. Nope, that ain't nothing. Where the hell that room at? I get lost as shit. Why? How much y'all want to bet they're going to have me escape? Like, I'm going to start this ritual. And, and you might you might think... All right, I thought you was going to do something. You might think this ritual to save these kids is probably to just let some demon out. You know what I'm saying? So, yeah, it is what it is, y'all. Let's go ahead and start this thing. That looked real painful. We good? We good? I'm leaving. What they want me? What now? What now? Do I just go? Do I go? Do I leave? This lock. I can't leave. These it. Yeah, these it. 
Oh, they open. Well, one open. Hey, kids. Another part of the house? What the hell is this? After successfully banishing the ghost, you decided to drop into a hole pointed by one of the spirits of the kids. Inside the hole, there was an underground passage that helped you leave the house. You went home, tried to talk to a few people at work about your incident inside the house, but no one believed it. A few months after, you found a newspaper saying that the house was demolished and some of the furniture and toys were donated to an orphanage home. You decided to leave everything behind and move to a new city for a fresh start. I got the good ending. This game got two, four, four, two, four endings. You know, I saw the two over the four and I was like, well, that was it. That game, I mean, how the hell could you get the other endings? You know what I'm saying? Like, it's only, it's only, that's what I'm saying. They say 35 to 40 minutes. So I'm guessing they meant, because it's been 40 minutes. So I'm guessing they meant maybe like per session. You feel me? But it, like, how could you get the other end? It was two doors up there, and I guess I picked the right one. But then that lead the question of, well, what's up with the other end? What, just leave? You know what I'm saying? I don't know. Like, before you go in the house, just turn around and go home? I done seen games do that. But I like that game. Not because it was good, but because it was a game with with no threat. It wasn't a game where you had to survive and shit. They make it seem like it because you can run and you can hide. With them two mechanics in the game, chances is you got to, you know, survive. But I like this. They make you think you got to survive. Even when hiding, you ain't have to hide. It wasn't nothing out there. It was just a girl walking around. They wanted you to think you had to. Or maybe you did. Maybe it was a threat. I don't know. You know what I'm saying? But I did like this game. I think the flashlight was a little too dim. I think it could have been a lot brighter than it was. I can't really see this being a co-op game. What's the damn point in this being a co-op game? You feel me? What's the point in that? You don't need another person to play this game. I think the jump scares was real cheap. One of them caught me off guard. But it was just like, it, it ain't scary. And that's not why I liked it. I ain't liked it. I ain't like it because it was scary. I ain't like it because it was good. I just liked it because it, it was... It was just a game where I ain't have to sit there and run around, survive, and constantly die and find stuff. You know what I'm saying? Like finding the candles and the cross. They was all they was in specific spots and not too hard to find. And actually, they wasn't hard to find at all. The last one was kind of confusing. I was like, where the hell this thing at? Even solving a lock puzzle, it wasn't hard. You just find the notes. You know what I'm saying? And you go about your business. It was just a it was a decent little game. You know what I'm saying? It had basic assets in it, but it wasn't nothing hard. And for 40 minutes, come on. It is what it is. I mean, I didn't play games that was free, that was, you know, better than this and worse than this. You know what I'm saying? But it is what it is. If y'all want to try this game, try to get the other endings, I'll drop a link for the game. Let me know what y'all thought about this. If you want to see more horror games from me, check the playlist down below. And thanks for watching.